cool off. For a full list of cooling center locations and hours, visit our website, NBCPalmSprings.com. The heat wave is only adding to the extreme fire conditions facing the state and actually the entire West. Fire and emergency operations officials are already gearing up for what could be another record-breaking fire season. Our Kitty Alvarado has more on what firefighters could be facing. Experts are already predicting a fire season that could rival last year's, where a record 10 million acres were destroyed by flames, more than 4 million just in California. According to the National Interagency Fire Center, so far over a million acres have burned this year, topping last year's number by nearly 10,000 acres. What's even more concerning, fire officials say, conditions now are what they typically see in August or September. We're reaching critical levels where every point on the fuel moisture uh, model has a significant impact on fire behavior and how readily available that vegetation will burn. So that's extremely alarming, just the current conditions we're reaching. The California Governor's Office of Emergency Services, or CALF OES, is the central hub where experts gather to plan and manage resources during crises. Dry fuels, extreme heat, and drought have them planning for another long fire season. The biggest fires that we've had, they've all occurred in the last five years or so. So each year it keeps getting worse and worse. And now with uh, prolonged drought conditions, uh, the expectation is this is going to be another uh, historic season for us. They've already deployed mutual aid resources in high fire danger areas. Primarily strike teams, so additional firefighting resources, uh, dispatchers, water tenders, uh, all there just in case those conditions, you know, increase or get out of control. And it doesn't take much in these conditions for a fire to get out of control. In Santa Rosa, all it took was a spark from a tractor clearing brush. And saw a wall of flame that I have never seen in my life before. We have a heat advisory in place. These are not the conditions that we want to see people operating machinery in. With eight states under extreme weather warnings and hundreds of record temperatures on the brink of being shattered, fire officials hope there's enough firefighting power to stop fires before they turn into mega fires. That's that's one primary concern is our ability to continue moving resources around and the toll it takes on firefighters throughout the fire year. Kitty Alvarado, NBC Palm Springs.